and welcome back to Mum Talk YouTube. I wanted to share with you this week some products that I've been using on my skin. So I've been lucky enough to have been sent some products, but the first ones that I wanted to share with you, I was actually given um, on my birthday by my sister's boyfriend. They're by Bloom and Blossom. I think you can buy them from Space NK. And they do a sleep time um, pillow spray, a body oil, and then also a bubble bath. It's a beautiful bedtime routine and it's one that I love and have got really used to. Um, and I've always suffered with uh, achy legs throughout the whole of my life really since I was little, but in pregnancy a lot more. So before I go to bed, I literally wash my feet with ice cold water, even if I've taken a shower, ice cold water, and then rub the body oil on my legs from my knees, just above my knees, all the way down to my ankles and the tops of my feet. It's a beautiful smell. There's frankincense, um, evening primrose oil in here, and it's 99% natural, and it really is lovely. And then I spritz my, pe my pillow with the pillow spray, and I do sleep quite well normally, and I don't go anywhere without these two. I hardly ever take a bubble bath, so the bubble bath doesn't get used very often, but the pillow spray and the oil I use all the time. The one, my favourite one for my tummy is this one. It's the My Expert Midwife Fantastic Skin Elastic. I absolutely adore it. It's a really thick, it's almost like a serum rather than an oil. And it's really thick and it goes on beautifully and it really feels like it's working. Okay, it goes into your skin. I know that sounds really odd, but it really does feel like it's working. It goes into your skin, but it stays a layer of moisture, almost stays on top, which is lovely. It doesn't rub off on your clothes. It doesn't seem to rub off on mine. It certainly doesn't stain any or leave any oily residue, which is lovely. And then I also was sent from them Peri Prep Your Bits. If you have this, you know what it's for. It's for the perineum massage. Um, I have been struggling with doing that a little bit, but I am doing it maybe two or three times a week, which I think is enough. But I'm only 35 weeks right now, so I think I can up my game a little bit from next week. But this is a really nice one to use. It's 100% natural, smells lovely, um, and just feels really good. And then I also have been sent these two from Love Boo. What I loved, actually, that I failed to mention, about this one, this is in a glass bottle. <laughs> Hardly anything I've been sent has been in a glass bottle, which has been really disappointing. Um, but this is in a glass bottle, which is absolutely fantastic. These are plastic, which isn't so good. Um, and when you have a product that's 100% natural and then it's given to you in plastic, it's a little bit of a downer. But um, I know a lot of products, are, uh, a lot of brands are doing their best. Um, but it would be nice to see these in glass bottles. But this is a Miracle Oil, Stretch Mark Miracle Oil. I have been using this, so I take this when I go traveling because it's a little bit smaller than the My Expert Midwife one. Um, and it's 100 mil exactly. And I can use it on my tummy, you can use it on my back, on my bum, basically anywhere where you think you might get stretch marks, it's really good for. And then this is another one for the perineal massage, which I haven't used yet because I love this one and haven't done it enough. So maybe if I really go wild on my massage, I might get through two bottles, but who knows. But I will give this one a try. Um, but there are premium massage oils available on the market, which I didn't know you could actually buy them. Um, but you can use coconut oil and things like that, I think. And then I was also sent with the nappies. If you've watched the nappy podcast, I was also sent this Kit and Kin Stretch Mark Oil. Haven't used this yet, absolutely will, because I know this one is going to run out a lot um, and very quickly. So I will then jump onto these. And also with Stretch Marks, I've read a lot in that they say, you know, it is genetic. It might be that you don't see them until after birth, especially. Um, and if your mum had them, maybe you'll be more prone to them. If, they, if she didn't, maybe you won't have any. I've actually seen more. I haven't touched wood, got any on my tummy yet, but I've seen kind of a few more come on my bottom and my inner thighs. It's just a natural process of our bodies growing a little bit and making space for baby or the extra blood or the extra fluid. It's normal. Um, but if they're really bothering you, stretch mark oil is great for after birth as well. So these will come in absolutely handy. Um, I can't get my words out today, but these will come in handy after birth as well. 
So they're my favourite bits. I will link below um, where you can get them and the websites. And if you've got any questions about what they smell or the exact ingredients, let me know. Best way to contact me is through email, which is just mumtalkpodcast at gmail.com. Or reach out to me on social media, which is Emma Jolin on Instagram. That's probably the best way to get a hold of me. I'm pretty pants on Facebook and Twitter. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.